Hi YouTube, today I'm going to show you how to make this fabric flower. Okay, so this is what you're going to need for the tutorial. Um, you're going to need some silky fabric, um, a hot glue gun with extra glue sticks, also you're going to need a sharpie, you're going to need a nice candle, and some the templates that you make, you can make out of anything such as the candle, anything round really, to get the desired sizes you want. You're going to need a piece of tool. You're going to need a bead, which you can get anywhere, any type of bead. You could do a button, you can do anything. A little clip. This is um, Con Air, and I believe it was like 12 for a pack of them for like $2. Um, you can also need a piece of felt or a piece of fabric and some scissors. Okay, so the whole video got deleted, and I showed you guys, and I made this flower. Well, I guess I'll just show you guys how to do the tool part and how to burn the actual petals. And after you burn all the petals, you you just um, hot glue each layer together as it gets bigger. And you glue the tool on and you glue a button on. And then the backing. Like this. Okay, so let's go. How you burn this is you fold the pieces over. Like that. It's hard to do. Okay, and then you just start to burn it. If, the, if things start to catch on fire, it's okay. You just blow it out, or you can start all over again. You just take it, and you just, you just burn the edges, and it cur starts to curl. And the more you burn it, the more curled usually it gets. But don't go too crazy on that because I burnt a whole flower before. I'm trying to make it really curly. So pretty much when you're making your petals, you're going to make all different sizes. You can use anything to make your own templates. Just paper and round things you find around the house. That's what I did. And you cut them every other one. Like the biggest one, I made four. This one I made, I cut five times. This one I cut four times. This one five times. This one four times, obviously. And then you burn each of the petals. Well, yeah, each of the petals. And then you start to layer it. So this one, I just took the, and I just put them on top with hot glue. I just start to layer them like this. I'll show you with the paper. I just layered them. And then you can stick any kind of button or anything. This one's really shiny and glittery. And then just stick it all together. You can add the tool if you want to, and I'll show you how to do Much. that. What you're going to do with the tool is you're just going to pinch it and fold it. Pinch and fold, pinch and fold, pinch and fold, pinch and fold. And there you go. You have it like that. You can also cut it to make it more um, like a sharper line. Or you can just leave it poofy like this. Like for this one, I made it more um, pointed, but this one I kind of made it more round. And then you just glue it to the back like that. Also, you can take, which is easier, is to put a piece of felt and just hot glue it to the back. You can also take some fabric and just fold it along the backing and then hot glue that together. And it's just one big flower. Okay, so this is what it looks like done. And I hope you guys like it. I hope you found this helpful. And I hope you guys make these flowers. Um, yeah, so that's it. Good day. Bye.